a scarf, an afghan, or a pillow, this master of crochet can do it all. He spends several hours each day perfecting his technique, and get this, he's only 11 years old. Watch this. <laughs> Jonah Larson has been called a crochet prodigy. Hi, crochet friends, it's Jonah, and here's what I've been working on lately. His hands move at top speed, and he's sold hundreds of masterpieces made out of yarn. And now, what you really want to see is me crocheting. Jonah was just five years old when he first discovered crochet tools in a box of crafts. He watched tutorials on YouTube and has been hooked ever since. Today in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make these adorable baby shoes. Today, he's got tens of thousands of Instagram followers and receives fan mail from all over the world. Goodbye and crochet away. Y'all give it up for Jonah Larson. Hey, Jonah. What's up, bud? Thank you for inviting me. Of course. Yes, I, it's astonishing watching you because you talk to the camera, but your hands are moving yeah. so fast. How long does it take you to practice? How long did it take you to get to that point? It took me about three years. Uh, three I started years. when I was five, and I noticed that that happened when I was eight. Wow. Um, How much yarn do you go through in a week? Well, let's just say I keep the yarn companies in business. <laughs> <laughs> On average, 22 to 25 skeins. Wow. wow. What, is, what is a skein? Um, a, a ball. Like a ball of yeah. yarn. OK. What got you into this? Well, I found a crochet hook and a bag of crafts my aunt gave us. And I inquired of my mom what it was. She told me it was a crochet hook. And then she helped wow. me find a tutorial. And then from there, you just fell in love with it? Yes. Oh you find it relaxing? Yes, it's very relaxing. All right, well, Jonah's mom, Jennifer, is in our audience. Her son's work is so stunning, some people are convinced she does it for him. Miss Jennifer, that's not the case, right? It is not the case. I would love to take credit for Jonah's work, but I've never crocheted in my life. <laughs> you've, you've never even gone near it. You haven't done it. I have never done it. And the only hook I've ever picked up are the ones he leaves scattered around the house. <laughs> do you find, because crocheting is such a diverse audience, do you find that people come to you as an 11-year-old boy and ask for your advice about it? Yes, that happens very commonly on my page. Because <laughs> it's, and I, I did a piece once with crocheting, and I just posted it. And it got a flood of feedback because the, commu the crochet community is huge. And they're very kind, too. They are very nice. Yes. They are very so You're very kind. Thank Miss you. Yeah. <laughs> Miss Jennifer, are you surprised that your son took this up? This hobby? I was surprised. It's not something typically that a five-year-old does. <laughs> um, yeah. But um, he was just a natural at it. And I thought maybe he would stop after a year, but he just kept going and getting better. Yeah. Wait. What is the most difficult thing to make, most challenging article? That would be doilies, because the yarn is oh, so yeah. thin and the hook is tiny. It's really hard to maneuver it. Oh, oh that's There's beautiful. One. That's a beautiful doily. I've never said that before, but that is a beautiful doily. I was about to ask you if you knew what a doily was. I don't know. I don't have a reference point for doilies, but that looks like a really nice doily. Yeah, it is beautiful. That must have took a lot of time. Yeah, it did take quite a while. Now tell us about your business. Well, my business is called Jonas Hands, and I sell everything possible. And I have an Instagram page and a Facebook page. Wonderful. And it's pretty successful, right? Yeah. If I could you do stuff to order, like if I wanted like a sweater or a new hat or a scarf, I could be like, can you do this for me? And you would yeah, do it? I can do that. If I wanted like specific colors, if like I was a sports fan or something like that, you can do it all, right? Yep, I can certainly do that. Oh my God. Well, do you think you could finish something? By the end of the show? Yes, I can. I believe he's in you. He's very confident. I love it. Well, he's been fast at work on his yarn creation all hour, and he's ready to present it. All right, Mr. Jonah, show us what you made. OK, I made a Jonah beanie for you for my personalized hand tag. Nice. For me? You made this from scratch. Oh, my gosh. This is crazy, man. This is what you made out there. And then I didn't want you to feel left out, Ben, so I made you one. <laughs> Thank you, Jonah. You're a good man. Thank you so much. Wear mine too. Aww. Well, y'all make sure, get out of here, baby. Y'all check out his Instagram page called Jonah's Hands. Yes.